Cyberlab Neo GX is a new shader preset pack which can be found within the Cyberlab Mega Bezel Death to Pixels shader preset pack. These presets were all designed with 4K LG OLED TVs in mind, and they just look fantastic. In order to install the Cyberlab Neo GX shader presets, I've got a few short, simple video guides you can follow. In video 1, you'll have to configure Mega Bezel. In video 2, I'll show you how to install Cyberlab Mega Bezel Death to Pixels shader preset pack. Once you've followed both of those videos, open a game in RetroArch, and then press F1 to go to the Quick Menu. Once you're in the quick menu, you want to go all the way down to shaders. And then press enter. And then go to load. Mega bezel packs. Cyberlab. And then here you'll see a list of MBZ folders. MBZ0 is designed for more powerful computer systems. And if you go all the way down to MBZ5, these require the least power. So in this video, I'm going to go to MBZ0 Smooth Advance Full Reflections. And then once you're here, go down to Cyberlab Neo GX 4K Presets. And here are all of the Neo GX shader presets. So I'll talk you a little bit through what the naming structure is. So this one, for example, we have Cyberlab, who is the creator of the presets. And then we have NES, which is the game system. And then Composite, which is the cable type. So in this case, the Composite Cable. And then we have the CRT Mask. So in this case is the Shadow Mask. And as you can see here, there are four NES composite shadow masks. And then after the word shadow mask, you'll see something like sharp or fine or ultra. And with these, just cycle through each one of them and hopefully you'll find one that looks amazing on your TV screen. We also have shader presets that will work well with Cyberlab's Blog video filter. If you followed my Cyberlab video guide all the way through, you would have installed the Blog video filter too. Anyway, that's enough talking from me. Here's a quick showcase of Cyberlab's Neo GX shader presets for RetroArch. Yeah. 